peaches, so I know I look incredibly bad. Um, I was up really early this morning. I had to be up at 5 o'clock this morning to um, head off to work and be there in time to start my shift at 6 o'clock. Um, not complaining. I don't mind being up early, but um, today's just one of those lounging around sort of days. Um, this video's topic, actually, I'm just pulling it up. Um, this video's topic actually um, revolves around a question that somebody sent me on Tumblr. Now, before I continue, if you do want to send me questions on Tumblr, you are free to do so. Links in the description below. Try to be respectful. You know, don't send me, like, really horrible, nasty things, please. I really don't appreciate that and will not tolerate it. So just please think before you post. Um, but <laughs> you can send them anonymously or non-anonymously. It's completely up to you. But um, somebody sent me an anonymous one on Tumblr, so I wanted to um, talk about it. So anyways, the question is, Hey Paige, I've been threatened before over Facebook by someone who said they were going to beat me up. They don't live in my area, but I'm still somewhat worried. What should I do? Okay, well, before I address this, first of all, I know that I'm completely and utterly white right now. It's because there's sun shining in through that window, and it's making me look really white. Whiter than I am. Uh, <laughs> but, okay, threats. Here's my thoughts, or thoughts, on threats. I think that threats are thrown out there, and threats are said when somebody feels like they're losing a battle or a fight. You know, like they think they're losing... And they're like, oh my god, if you continue to do this, I'm going to beat you up. I'm going to find you. I'm going to beat you up. And if you don't if you don't shush and you continue what you're doing, I'm just going to make your life miserable. They, they think it'll make them stronger and all that good stuff. That's just my thoughts. Most of the time, people just um, threaten others to, once again, make themselves seem superior and significantly more powerful than the other person or other people involved in the fight or the argument. About if you still are somewhat, um, you know, paranoid or iffy about it, you could talk to your parents. Um, I don't know if you're in school or not, I don't know, but um, there's counselors you could talk to. I don't mean that rudely, but there's counselors you could talk to. Parents are like number one support system. Uh, for me at least, uh, so I would talk to my parents if, if I was you, but you could talk to people if you still have paranoia or if you're iffy about it or if you have a bad feeling about it. So anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, to the person who sent me the um, question on Tumblr, I really hope that things work out for you, honestly. Just make sure that you have people around you who love you. And again, if you do want to talk to somebody, um, parents, trusted friends, counselors, if you would like to speak to a counselor, that's your choice. But keep people around you that you can talk to and who you can trust. Anyways, that's about it, guys. Peace. I love you all. Live, laugh, love, and have a good day or night, depending on when you watch this video. Talk to you guys later. Bye.